Please, it's important. Sit down. This is not a pickup. Uh, buy your drink? No, thank you. Now, what's so important that I can do for you? I want you to do something for yourself. Like what? Leave Chicago now. Please, Mr. Drake. You, you, uh, you know my name. Just go away. Now, please. You must leave this town for your own sake. What are you talking about? You could be in terrible trouble if he ever gets to you. He knows you are here. Uh, who is he? We're closed. I've got to get in there. Do you know what time it is? I, We're closed. I'm sorry, but I'm coming in. All right, mister. What's this all about? The man that just came in here. Where is he? What man? There's no man here. I saw him. I just saw him. Where is he? I don't know. There's no man here. We're closed. You got a rear exit? Of course we have. It's a city regulation. So what? Maybe he went out the back door. And then you get out the front door. Here, stop. What is the trouble here? I don't know, Mr. Perdido. This man barged in. He said somebody came in this shop. You must be mistaken, sir. There's no one else here. What's in the back? I'm sorry, but it's private. I only want to take a fast look. No, I want you. Mr. Drake, can you hear me? Mm. Does that hurt? No. You don't seem to have a concussion. I think it's only a bad bruise. How'd I get here anyway? I don't seem to remember. I followed you to the antique shop. When I went in, you were unconscious. 
I called a cab and he helped me to carry you out. Didn't they try and stop you? I persuaded them to let you go. What time is it? Just past noon. Noon? Oh, no, no. No, you must rest. That's better. for someone named Drake. That would be uh, Donald Drake in room 519. Is he in? Not now. I haven't seen him since last night. Thank you. Want to leave a message? No. Who shall I say is asking? No one. Nobody. Unexpected call. I have to leave town for a few days. Not until you give me some answers. As you wish. Let me go! Is that how you really got me out of that store last night? Yes. You know, I don't get you. First you rescue me with this gun, then you turn it on me. I only meant to threaten you so I could get away. You're in trouble, and I can't risk being involved any deeper. The trouble, am I in? That, that, that fight in the store? The man you fought with, he's dead. An accident. Fallon hit his head. The only accident is that you weren't killed yourself. That's why he lured you there. Ralph led me there. I saw my brother go in that store. Not Ralph! He lured you there. What the hell are you talking uh, about? Farrick. Who? Beric, I don't know anybody by the name of Beric. Why should he want me there? It's part of his plan. You've interfered with it. Look, I... I... I tried to warn you last night and you wouldn't listen. When I saw you go into that antique shop, I knew it was a trap. I risked everything to rescue you. Why should you worry what happens to me? Oh, I couldn't just stand by and see Varric do to you what he did to all the others. And me. You and what others? Don't ask me about anyone else. Wait a minute. Did this uh, Varric have something to do with what happened to my brother? I can't tell you anymore. Well, if you can't, he will. Who? Your friend Varric. No, no, no. You mustn't look for him. Oh, yes, I've got to. You're going to take me to him. Now. Yes, in there. Remember, you insisted on this meeting. Go! Good evening. Can I be of service? Mr. Varick, uh, the name is Frazier. 